Hey, I'm Sarah Tallmash, and I'm about to play the game Drunk or a Kid with posts from Reddit. I tried moving furniture around mostly because I hated how it was laid out. Then the IKEA manager told me to stop and go away. That feels drunk. I feel like being drunk in an IKEA sounds fun. Kid, oh my god. Um, maybe I should just be a kid. Okay, she cried for an hour because I wouldn't let her pick my nose. Well, I feel like that is something that a kid would be upset because they I feel like they love picking their noses and they don't understand why it's bad yet. Like I feel like if you told an adult that they were like, no, I get it. Drunk. Oh my goodness. Who are these people? I feel like I don't ever remember anything when I'm drunk. I don't remember having temper tantrums though. But I do remember crying. Try to kill a fly on my hand with a soldering iron. Needless to say, the fly was quicker. I mean, I've done arts and crafts when I'm drunk and I've, I've burned myself really bad thinking that I can do some crafts really fast before I go to bed. After I had a few drinks and then the next day I'm like, my hands are raw. So I think that one's gotta be drunk. Ah, I took my shoes and socks off, climbed up to the top of a six to 10 meter tall Australian football post and waved two cars as they went by. I feel like it's gotta be drunk because I feel like Australians are always drunk every time I meet them. Kid, oh, I'm like way off on all these. My family lives in Australia. <laughs> They're mental. I remember we, my friends and I, this is before that show Jackass, but we really like doing like kind of jackassery things. Like I would dry, ride my bike into those bushes that are hedges or ride my bike straight into the lake. This one's gross, but just like, you know, being in the public pool. <laughs> That's not me, but that was one of my friends, but that was the kind of circle of friends that we had. I, my friend of mine talked me into, I had walkie talkies and he talked me into, he said they could probably work underwater and I put them underwater and then they broke and then when I thought about it, I was like, why would I even want to talk underwater and you wouldn't even understand anything. So I broke my walkie talkies and then I had to explain it to my parents and it was so embarrassing to, for them to realize that they have a kid that's not that smart.